One trip to the moon is 103 Mississippi rivers, is 30 Earths, is 3.5 million football fields. I'm working on a project called Empty Space, and it's kind of a two-part project that involves a dome and a walkway. Um, and the viewers will be invited to walk through the walkway. They'll be reading different kind of facts um, based on uh, trying to find commonalities between large scale and small scale things and trying to find that human space in between. And then they'll be invited into the dome where they'll be watching a series of short uh, animations. I've been calling it a psychedelic planetarium to have friends that I've been trying to describe the project to, but using a lot of what I term lo-fi uh, techniques to create images that seem very scientific or very hi-fi, um, again as a way to bridge the scales between uh, human beings and things that are really, really, really large or really, really, really small. I tried reading a lot of these textbooks on science that are intended for a more general audience and more often than not they rely on analogies to uh, try and convey their their uh, their topics but uh, I found dice coming up a lot in these analogies uh, even thinking about Einstein quote uh, God does not play dice as a way to figure out whether or not randomness exists or quantum theory is something that can be trusted uh, so I just sort of gravitated towards naturally and I found that it works really well in terms of uh, mimicking a star as well as a particle. So it's a nice, flexible, wonderful, fun unit to work with. So a big part of my work is trying to make that bridge between people who possess uh, what I think is a comprehension of science and the rest of the world who just kind of puts it in faith of what, what science is actually doing. When you think about the Super Bowl, you generally don't think about space or particles necessarily. Um, but uh, I think when I first visited the site, uh, there's a big empty parking lot um, and so I started thinking about this term empty space uh, in a way to, to enact this empty space and even though the project isn't happening on the parking lot anymore still thinking about this sort of empty space or this void uh, that fills both uh, the space between atoms as well as the space between stars um, and trying to think about something as huge as a Super Bowl and how important that is to people and yet at the same time when we take a look at the larger scope it's, it's a pretty small event uh, so again, trying to get a better perspective about things. Uh, no uh, disrespect to the Super Bowl, I think it's an amazing thing. But, you know, on the galactic scale, uh, it's not that big. It is 840,000 million cubits, it is 1,700 Ironman triathlons, it is 460,000 Burj Khalifas, it is 208 Iditarods.